Hello to everyone watching this footage. So Firethon here again, and I hope everyone had a fine Christmas. So I'm going to introduce myself for newcomers. I am high-functioning autistic, I'm obsessed with fiction, and I'm planning to make my own creative universe like the late Stan Lee did. For this particular footage involves a character that I have introduced through um, illustrations, and a character that is in a subdivision that you guys might be new to and such. For this particular footage, I'm going to introduce characters Kaiga and Dagger. Starting with Kaiga, and these are data sheets, so just bear with me as I introduce them to you. I'm trying to make this fair and symmetrical on your guys' behalf. Just bear with me. Kaiga. Real name, none. Height, 450 feet. Weight, 90,000 tons. Status, anti-hero in Rival of Kaijericus. Base, quirky dimension. Mobile. Intelligence, two brains. Behavior, loopy, protective, and willful. She enjoys helping others without a care. Lethality, only during a fight. Weaknesses, low IQ and being rivaled. Powers, she possesses similar powers as Kaijericus with a few differences that include nuclear vision and solar breath. Eyes, deep orange. Hair, deep black, short, and scruffy. Origin, in the quirky dimension, the native Kaijericus is rather an imperfect duplicate of the Queen of the Mutants, known only as Kaiga. One day, Kaizara, the evil counterpart of Kaijericus, traveled to the quirky dimension through the villainous vortex and convinced Kaiga that she was the innocent counterpart and told her to defeat the true Kaijericus. And due to her low IQ, she agreed to do so. Luckily, Kaijericus explained to Kaiga after a time of fighting that Kaizara is nowhere close to being innocent, which led to them deciding to team up against Kaizara. Since then, Kaiga will always think twice before she helps someone with an objective just to avoid getting the wrong message. Costume She's covered in reptilian scales. Teams Solitary with Kaijericus and others. Original inspiration, Kaijericus and DC's Bizarro. So basically, she's an imperfect duplicate of Kaijericus, and I hope you guys don't feel confused about the data and such. I'm just trying all that I can to keep it in proper symmetry. Now I'm going to introduce a character that I have shown through illustrations for those who are able to access my blog through hyperlinks and other subdivisions. Uh, bear with me. Huh. Sorry. I, oh, I am so sorry about that. It just... It was inadvertent. I, I'm in, I am so sorry. I, I'm sorry. Sorry about that. Just ignore that point. Um, so this is the character. Dagger. Real name, Rosie Chains. Height, 6 feet, 1.5 inches. Weight, 172 pounds. Status, hero and bounty hunter. Base, New York City, and mobile. Intelligence, three and a half brains. Behavior, moody, tough, and stubborn. She always wants to get in the fight. Lethality, highly lethal, both physically and verbally. Weaknesses, she has a dedicated romance with fear, who's practically the only person that could make her feel happy. Bowers, she can sprout sharp steel spikes from anywhere on her body. Some she could detach and use as a weapon, and some are for display. She's also immune to fear gas, has a cute sense of hearing and smell, some martial arts, 
and possesses a strong healing factor. Eyes light green, hair light blonde in chin length. Origin Rosie Chains was a young girl who was born with the ability to sprout metallic spikes from her body. When her parents learned of this, they abandoned Rosie in an orphanage, where she was brutally treated until she was finally kicked onto the streets by the age of seven. By adulthood, she became a skilled bounty hunter and eventually met the nightmarish fear. Though they were rivals for a time, they were forced to team up in order to defeat the murderous Leverakush, and soon became great lovers. Dagger even asked for Fear's hand in marriage, and all the heroes and anti-heroes went to their ceremony. They are also allies with the bladed genius Madame Shear. Costume She wears a black leather jacket with matching jeans and boots. Team Solitary with Fear and other heroes. Orange Inspiration, Marvel's Marrow. So, I severely apologize. It, I think it was closed out or something, and I had to be able to recover it, so I apologize. I hope you guys enjoyed this footage, and um, if you guys have any more questions and concerns, you could just answer to me and such. I would try my best to answer back. And if you guys want, you could like, subscribe, and comment down below. It's your choice. And until next time, I hope you guys had a good Christmas. And hopefully you guys would have a fine New Year's Eve in the long run. And I um, hope you guys have a fine time and such. And until next time, in transmission.